My name is Maritza. I am from El Salvador, which is the smallest country in Central America, but to me it's the most beautiful one. El Salvador has humble, kind, and very hardworking people. I grew up with a single mother who was a hardworking woman and did her best to support me. Sometimes she had to leave me with my grandparents and my aunts to be able to go to work. Because of the distance of where she worked, I only see her once a month. I was her only child. I didn't have any siblings. I often felt lonely. I struggled so much when I was a little kid in kindergarten. I didn't finish kindergarten because I was so sick with bronchitis and I missed a lot of days from the school. I didn't like to go to the school, but there was a very special place where I loved to go. And that special place was church. Close to my grandparents' house, there was a small, tiny church. I remember they were giving Sunday school classes, so I asked for permission to go. Sunday mornings, I ran to the class to hear what the pastor was going to teach and I enjoy learning more and more about God. At the end of the three months of Sunday school classes, we were told that we were going to have a celebration and maybe we were going to have a gift. When we walked into the church, there were big cardboard boxes and inside were these beautiful red and green boxes. We start being called one by one, nay by nay. When I walked to the front and I received my two box, I was very curious to know what was inside the two box. When I opened the two box, I remember this fresh, clean and sweet smell of the two box. There were so many things, not just one item, but so many items that were for me. There was two favorite items, Slinky and a journal. That journal was so special to me because I didn't have anything similar to that. I didn't even want to use it at all. That shoe box brought me joy, gladness, and reassurance of God's love that even though my mom was not able to be there with me all the time and my dad was not there, God was always there with me, taking good care of me, and he was always present and always going to be present. What's beautiful. I want to thank you all for packing two boxes and bringing hope to children around the world. May the Almighty God bless each of you.